ready to fight. Ready. All right, United Center, Chicago, Illinois, seemingly an annual destination for the combat sports leader. And great to have a UFC fight night back here in the Midwest. Although I love coming to Chicago. I love coming to this arena because the fans are so knowledgeable. This city welcomes the UFC with open arms every single time. And tonight, we come with a banger of a fight card. Big power shot there. Nice hook lands by Early. A little bit of extra sauce on that one as well. She felt like she'd be able to get inside and did a nice job to close the distance there. Well, she knew that if she threw it, she had to throw it with intent. That was with intent and landed with a lot of impact. Pennington's now dealing with a cheat cut. It's just a really high pace, too. It's a really high striking pace for these two. Man, these women are delivering for fight fans around the world. What a start to this fight. How could you possibly be seated when you are watching this level of activity from these two women at the beginning of the fight? Oh, clean hook there. Just over three minutes to go, round one. Well, hard to see exactly where she is cut, but it's somewhere around that eye area. Doesn't look great. It's never good to get cut, but right now it's a small one. You don't have to worry about it, but you got to protect it. So as we pull up some numbers here for you, 29 total strikes and counting that have landed for Raquel Pennington. Shot a double leg. Oh, look at that. Picks her up and promptly puts her down. Have you ever been on the wrong end of a slam like that? I mean, I've been thrown around in my life. Anytime you wrestle, as long as yeah. I have, you have been thrown around, and it does not feel good. And it doesn't feel good. Oh, that one got through. I'm not sure how many more she can take. So she backs up here and lets her opponent stand up. Well, a bloody mess it is not, but that cut is getting worse by the minute. It just keeps advancing. Double leg shot. Beautiful. Oh, how about the slam there? That one cannot feel good. Mm, that was nice. She's got her back now, DC, and I don't mean she's like there to support her, right? She is literally on her back and in control of this fight. She's in control of this fight. Look for her to start trying to slide that arm under the neck to finish the fight with a choke. Oh, beautiful job by her to reverse position on the ground, and now she's in a spot to maybe finish this fight. Yeah, she did a really good job of reversing the position and going right on the offense to gain her dominant position. That's a very high fight IQ. All right, so Nunes has just got full mount now. Oh, she got her flattened out there. This is a terrible position. 20. Pennington's eye is starting to swell shut. Tonight, her opponent's hurt. Beautiful placement on that hook. What a great job of finding such a massive shot. Well, I'm not sure if the swelling is just cosmetic. She might be severely injured. Let's look back at some replays from that round. Well, when you take shots that clean, you're... You ready to fight? You ready? Round two is on the way. All right, well, she's landed those hooks at a high clip here tonight. Actually, some fans are starting to call her Mrs. Lineker. I think it's a pretty good nickname. Oh, it's a great nickname because they fight in the same as double leg shot. Oh, massive slam. That'll change the complexion of this one. Oh, beautiful job by her there to reverse the position on the ground. Oh, well played there as she gets back to her feet. as the cut continues to get worse. It appears as though it's starting to affect her a little bit. Yeah, it's starting to affect her. You can see it. Quick entry here. Nice single leg like, entry. Oh, 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 oh. Beautiful transition. Nunez is looking to pass here, denied by the opponent. Back to the feet now. Shot of double leg. So how oh, oh, did she just ruin her there as she slams her opponent to the ground? I bet that hurts your back just watching it. It hurts my back, it <laughs> hurts your back, but it doesn't feel any worse than it does to that young lady right. that just got slammed on her back. I mean, she is feeling that. Oh, nice. 
All right, so another nice sequence for her there. You've talked a lot about her fight IQ, but this is pretty simple, right? You batter your opponent upstairs. Stay with her. She did it early. She was able to get to her spots, land the shots that she wanted to land. Her opponent did nothing to change it. And now she finds herself in a comfortable position where she has to just keep targeting the face that is so swollen right now. Oh, good series of knees by her there. I'm not sure. Her best strike in the fight. Her best strike. And you don't see this type of strike. It's a fake clap. If she lands, if she lands, very effective. And now some knees. Well, pretty good recovery by her opponent after being stunned. But we see this all the time, right? If you don't close the Dean steps in. Oh, my goodness. What a fight. So how about this result tonight? She told us in the fighter meeting, I got to get a finish here tonight. She absolutely kept the judges out of it. That is her signature win, and this crowd enjoyed every minute of it. Signature win, John. She has never looked better. She said she was going to get a finish. She got the finish. What a tremendous performance by this young lady. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at three minutes, 31 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout, Amanda the Lioness Nunes. I mean, that was just insane. We look to our left, see the, re see the reaction from Dana White and Hunter Campbell. Amanda Nunes 